When a man wears a mask, you know he is either trying to hide from something, or hide something from himself. In the case of Smolder, it's probably both. Those who work with him regularly call him Mick, but it's fairly certain that's not even his real name. Although he'd rather keep to himself, the noir-esque nature of his simple outfit does not help him blend in at all. Besides the mask, the only standout item on his person is a now faded yellow badge, with a blue bird of prey adorning it. A symbol of a bygone era, as Smolder used to be a member of the Sentinels during his time in the LEGO universe. Another unusual point is his mechanical right hand. Crude but effective, he says he'd rather be able to work on it himself than have something fancy that's complicated. Though he never talks about how he lost his hand, it definitely occurred after the LEGO universe was sealed from travel. It appears this is also when he began wearing the mask. Somewhat skilled in combat, Smolder has occasionally participated in yarn and beast hunts, becoming particularly fond of powder keg weaponry. After hearing tales about the far side, a place at the edge of the realm of the living of neon lights in eternal night, Smolder began searching for a man best known as the Aviator, as it was rumored he knew how to get to the far side. He hoped it would be a place he could rest a while, and to think. <laughs>